Oh my god, today is the day guys. Today is the day. Last week I made a video on the Aston Martin Vantage and Aston Martin and in that video I said that we were going to do something really really special, really really like really really good, something on that day. And unfortunately, it rained on that day. It rained like for a couple days last week. It's probably not going to rain anymore and those two days were the days that we had a chance to do something like ridiculous. But we're doing that right now, today. I skipped school for this. I I probably shouldn't have. I did. It's become like a, a, a routine now, like skipping school for car shows and car events. But I'm not gonna complain. I'd rather go to car events than go to school. So today, we are going to that special place. I'll let you know more once we get there. Look at this view. Okay, we arrived at the house. This is what I was so excited about last week. Um, yeah, yeah. I don't know if you guys can see behind me, but but what? Okay, watch this. Come along, come along, come along with me. Oh my god, just, just looking in front of this, this is like insane. Give you here. I'll show you guys right now. Can you guys name the cars? Okay. Instead of that, let's roll the B-roll. That is just the GT2 RS. Just come on, look at this. They're very clean. Like it. Like it. <laughs> Tristan's in the F40. Uh, yes, so this garage has F40, the 2 RS, Daytona, and and another car right here. I do not know exactly what this is. What? What is it? Uh, 1964. What? Corvette Stingray. Corvette Stingray. So yeah, that's Jeez, a. Jeez, how do you get out of this car? Tristan oh. stuck. Oh. Tristan is stuck. What the hell? Get out. And pull this. No way. Yeah. Deep. Holy shit, the clutch is hella fucking stiff. Oh my god. Look at all the carbon. Tristan, tell us more about this car. Dude, this is the very first production car, street legal, to have carbon fiber in it. Very first one. So basically, all the carbon fiber you see in here is the very first car ever. So this year, I don't know, this year's car, um, I'm not sure, 1991. So this was like basically the very first time the carbon fiber was ever put, put on a real car since the formula one cars if i could close this the formula one cars always had carbon fiber in it and it was only put in like aerospace and like space technology so this car you could maybe you could see it the paint work you could even see the carbon fiber work just through the paint barely see it but you Usually you'd see a carbon fiber weave from this paint. So it's a very special car. And it's definitely a car that's very valuable. Okay, so I'm inside the Ferrari F40. It was a pain in the ass to get in. It, I mean look at I mean just look at this. Like, how do you get over this? Like it's all carbon fiber, so you don't want to touch it. Especially when it's not your car. Does it uh, sound good? And yes, I mean, right away you could just tell it's a 90s car. Oh, like the buttons. This is like wool. Like, it's wool. Look how small this mirror and the mirror is. It's ridiculous how small the mirror is. The seats are somewhat comfy though. The seats are somewhat comfy, even though they're all carbon fiber on the back and just cloth in the front. Or like on top of it, 
but yes, I'm inside a Ferrari for F40. First time. I have to be careful though. The carbon fiber, there's so much carbon fiber and it's worth a lot of money. Like this car is worth a lot of money. I don't want to mess around with it. Okay, now that was the F40. I'm not sure exactly how much this one is, but they're, they're, they're expensive. And another expensive Ferrari is this car right here. The Ferrari Daytona. Nicknamed the Daytona because it won the, the Daytona race. So yes, this one is a lot of money too. It's very sick. It's also it's known for its really long nose, shark nose. It's a very sick car. Okay, the last car in this collection right now is the Curl GT. Roll the beer. That is it. That is the CGT and that's basically the collection that I was so excited to come here. I mean, yes, you see these cars pretty often at car shows and stuff, but seeing it in person where there's not tons of people around you blocking your way or closed off, it's it's really special. This car seeing in person, uh, even a personal one, not a dealership one. Very, very, very cool to see. Okay guys, that is the end of the video. I wish I got more time with these cars, but um, the guy who's showing us the car is gonna leave soon, so we can't spend more time with them. But in the future, since they live pretty close to where we live in here in San Diego, maybe we could hang around with them for a day during SEC or something like that and bring these cars out to show them to the, the people here. They do bring it out sometimes, but not as often as uh, we go to so maybe one day we'll we'll go with them film it do like a whole complete review or whatever you guys want to see of any of these cars the Daytona Stingray 2RS and the F40 and the CGT um, I'll have to ask the owner uh, See if he's willing to take it out But if he does let me guys know what kind of video you guys want to see a review like a video on how it drives, the performance, how it looks, or like, you know, any of that kind of videos that I make, let me know in the comments below. And that's it. That's basically the video. I hope, uh, I wish I get more time with it, but I don't. But meanwhile, let's enjoy this view. And it's such a nice house too. Such a nice collection. Okay guys, see you. Bye.